I just finished a new show on HGTV called Clipped. Uh, it's an awesome competition show. You have to check it out. It's on Discovery Plus or on HGTV. People are so talented on that show. They're designing topiaries, backyards. My co-host is Martha Stewart, who you might know. Uh, so it was great to work with her and see just how talented some people are in this, in, in this world. I mean, it was incredible watching them work. When it comes to designing your outdoor space, the thing I always say is start small. Uh, I love a stone patio because it's a one-time cost. Uh, you put down some nice stones, you don't have to worry about painting the boards of a deck or replacing the boards of a deck. If a patio is done right, it'll last for decades. You can put your grill right out there, put some Adirondack chairs. If you want a fire pit, that can go right on there as well. During the summer, I love having all my friends and family come over. And the last thing you want is having bugs ruining it. Uh, that's the number one complaint I get from people is, how do I get the bugs out of my backyard? Now I tell them, go to Hotshot. They have the complete line of products for everything that's flying, creeping, crawling, and my least favorite, stinging. Uh, they have a product that is perfect for it. It's an ant, roach, and spider killer. It comes in three scents, scent-free, floral, or lemon. Uh, floral is my favorite, and the great thing about it is that you spray it on, it's not sticky, and it lasts for up to three months. Go to hotshot.com, they have everything you need to make sure that your outdoor entertaining is the best all summer long. Everyone wants a green lawn, and it all starts with mowing correctly. Uh, during the summer, you actually want to raise the height of the mower up to about three inches. Any lower, and it'll dry out and brown out quickly, so you want to get it a little higher for the rest of the summer. Uh, and make sure the blade's sharp. If the blade is dull, it'll actually tear the grass, which can lead to disease. When it comes to watering, you want to water early, early in the morning. 4 or 5 a.m. is the best time to water before the heat of the day. You water about three times a week, depending on the type of grass you have, and you water for 20 to 30 minutes per zone, or in your backyard if you have a sprinkler. That way it kind of mimics Mother Nature, long sustained watering, so that way it gets down deep to the roots. You water during the day in the heat of the sun, when that water hits the grass, it'll just evaporate. If you water at night, uh, the grass is gonna get soggy, it can lead to mildew and mold, so you don't want that at all. So early morning, three days a week, and for 20 to 30 minutes per zone, and you're gonna have a lush green lawn all summer long.